Oh wait, so wait, it said I was about to. <laughs> Did you see me I'm trying to figure out without my glasses if I still had time to tell you hot or not? I can do this all day long. Orlando Bloom, not hot. Well, I thought he was in high school, but he's also into Jim Morrison. Oh wait a second. Okay, wait. Okay, yeah, fine. Fine, Katy Perry. I was trying to be respectful. She doesn't care. Gee, easy. I don't know what he looks like. <coughs> the honestly videos I watch are the ones where after you broke her heart. Well, after she broke your heart, she's bad at love. So I know what she looks like, and I know exactly what all those girls look like. Um, is the guy hot in Cher Lloyd's video, I Want You Back, when I was trying to look up the Hain video, I Want You Back? No. That's like a Justin Bieber type of situation. Is Justin Bieber hot? I guess, but only because of that guy Calvin. I don't like the neck tattoo. I don't like neck tattoos, so you're out. You're Charlie XCX. Starting to hate all tattoos. You can get one tiny tattoo that no one can see that says Juniper if you let me write it on your neck in Sharpie every day. <laughs> That's Ryan Patterson. Then everybody else will be like, she'll put eyeliner on you. I stopped doing that a long time ago, guys. Colt, don't get excited. We're sad. I gave up. Ryan Patterson looks so bad in eyeliner. I was like, yeah. I started to think maybe nobody does. I called a girl that I thought was a guy in Chili's yesterday, because now it's t today. Yesterday is yesterday. Tomorrow is forever, so our diamonds. I thought it was a guy. But it looked just like that guy, Billy Joe. No. What's that guy's name? They knew exactly what I was talking about, so apparently I nailed it. I was like, hey, Green Day. She was like, he, she. And then she proceeded to complain about someone in the parking lot, and I thought, and then I turned to the manager and I said, uh, she was trying to figure out how to activate my cash app card so I could pay for my $6 Miller Lite. That obviously was not happy hour. That was my punishment for drinking. I felt sick. I'm going to drink more coffee. Jeff Goldblum is hot, obviously. Bill Murray is weirdly hot to me, but just because we were raised on old SNL. Even Chris Farley is hot to me. It's all about the humor. Eh, they know that on Perk, that's why they were confused. I'll tell you the hot guys in Perk that aren't hot to me. Well, I never saw a picture of Kelton Closet. He's just so rude that he is unhot. He's Australian, okay, he's probably hot. Yeah, okay, I'll go there. <laughs> just kidding. Not. Because I know hotter people in Australia. It's a competition of hotness. My friends win every time. I can tell you their names. Just look them up on my Facebook. Whoever the Dintroid isn't really hot. He's just cute. His glasses eating durian. He doesn't want to be hot. Leave him alone. Joffrey is hot, but so depressed it ruins it. He sent me a picture of himself in the woods in a beanie, and it was just him like this. Not looking at the camera. <laughs> Thinking about Monty Python and all the art they stole. His eyes were downcast. Jonathan's hot, but only because he looks like Severus Snape. He said the universe will never let me find him. He says, no, I am the Matrix. Yes, he does. That's why he won't answer his phone. <laughs> Ask him about Tracy with the beautiful facey. Oh my god, I love him. Hexagon's hot and, and uh, he'd say, thank you. I appreciate that, but I can't do his... Never talk to him on the phone, I would have a heart attack. I can't handle British accents. I was trying to imagine being with someone with a British accent. <laughs> can't believe Harry Styles is British. <laughs> It is, what, how do British people do that when they're in our movies? Hello, Jude Law, looking at ya. Chris Martin. Why when they sing, when they act, I, my friend Terrell was the Queen of France at Ren Faire. She's been in, in professional theater since she was t practically in diapers. And I said, do it, do it, do it. Sound like Jonathan. She goes, I can't do that accent. I said, I was mad at her, I want to kick her ass. I said, what? I said, you spent all that time in England acting and you 
what? And she goes, doesn't mean I can do it. Americans can't do it. Just ask Nicole Kidman, who thinks she can be Virginia Woolf. As Graham Mills would say, woof. Not cute, not talented. Katie Holmes is super cute. What did they do to her? I never watched Baywatch. <laughs> she was in. Uh, Dennis told me, Julian Assange is with Pamela Anderson, Ocelot. That's all you need to know. That's why he's jealous. He doesn't love. <laughs> he's just mad. He's mad that Pamela Anderson, I said, if you're trolling me, Dennis, he goes, I wish I were. He said she came to his defense. I said, that can happen. And then I thought of Ocelot, and I thought, it can't happen, but that's a reverse situation. He can come to my defense. I'm no Julian Assange. Or am I? Did I mysteriously become Julian Assange because of Ocelot? Cool. I can't wait for you to show up in Nacogdoches as Pam Anderson. <laughs> and make someone who's the Ocelot of my life wildly jealous. I'm trying to think who's the most famous person I know. Mm, the famous people I know would never be jealous. They'd be like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> They're not really famous. Eric Huber is not really famous. And Gabriel Carmona is not. Just because you win an indie film award doesn't mean it. Russ Havard's probably the most famous, and he's so tired of hearing about me. He's like... He'd be like, I, I, I've got an art show in L.A. I've got an art show in New York. He's like, buy my tiny painting for $300. I'm like, no, give it to me for free. When she did. I don't know where that is. Probably gave it to my mom. Well, now she owes me 300 more dollars. Somebody tell her. She bought my bike for way too much. She said, can we just never talk about it again? I said, sure, 650 No. I said, mom, just give me $250. She said, $650. <laughs> She's, this is where I get it from. Oh, it's all coming clear here. Harry Styles, if you, no, Harry Styles is married to what's her face. I never knew who Olivia Wilde was. Yeah, it's amazing the people I don't know about the entertainment industry. It's probably I'm just walking around going gunga la gunga and thinking about Chevy Chase all the time. <laughs> oh my god, did you know that serial killer? No, no, the guy who killed his dad, the hedge fund manager guy? That hot guy? Yes. Maybe you look like him now, for sure. Because now I know his whole story. Oh my god. You're schizophrenic and you kill your dad. And you're friends with me on Perk and you say you don't know what I've done. Yes, I will be here for you. I was so sad when I found out he already had his juniper. Good for him. I'm proud of him. I'm proud of her. Wow, am I proud of her. But the only reason she was able to do that is because she was Chevy Chase's niece. This is the only stuff I'm interested on in the whole internet machine that Al Gore created. <laughs> for me, for Juniper. Wait until the two of us are hanging out in a room, <laughs> smoking cigars, talking about how we invented the internet. Yeah, I'll marry Al Gore. Only get revenge from Monica Lewinsky. Monica Lewinsky, she, maybe that's what happened. I gotta go, nobody's gonna watch these. I gotta download my YouTube stats thing and find out what countries people are obsessed with me and bye.